ladies and gentlemen and hi new subscribers today is saturday april 23rd 2016 as you guys can see something is different i cut my hair last night and what's in it is conditioner from last night i deep conditioned it overnight and it's still in my hair because the water is off for, because i guess they're doing like something with the plumbing maintenance whatever but i thought it was wednesday um and i kind of threw the letter away so i'm like and of course they don't answer the phone at the office so now i have this in my hair with no water <sighs> that's like irritating when you're renting an apartment i don't know if they do that like when you're renting a house or whatever but the struggle is like serious and i'm not feeling that well just say excuse me nehemiah so um yeah so i am starting over excuse this lighting Yamaya's going in the room i start i'm starting over um i got i talked to you guys in a quick video about me wanting to lock my hair and then not knowing if i wanted to cut it and do it natural um it was it it, it was locked like the roots there were a lot of them that were locked at the roots uh excuse me but the the chemical part like when i have my soft curl i had to keep retwisting it every day and i was getting irritated and, and i just don't got time to like be doing that i feel like i was you know putting too much into my hair and less time into you know either reading my bible or cleaning up around the house or doing stuff that i need to be doing instead i'm like let me fix my hair so that was getting irritated so finally i was just watching enough big chop videos on youtube and i'm just like I just I should just do it and not only that I was able to see my like I was telling you guys my natural curl pattern like um it's not a lot but I was able to see you know the waviness I was like okay this is pretty cool I've like never seen my natural hair before my mom was a cosmetologist and I just always had weaves from day one and just always chemicals and stuff so when I started seeing that I'm like okay okay and then it, it just pushed me enough to say let's just cut the the bad stuff off and just see what it does so when I can rinse this out I plan on finger coiling it myself um with my fingers I plan on doing that myself and I might wear that for a while maybe till I might wear it off and on until um it just gets I don't know it just forms and gets like some type of I don't know structure or I might just keep doing or just do the coils once and let it just you know stay in and let it lock up that way um it didn't take a lot for my hair to lock so I'm not worried about that I just wasn't feeling the retwisting and I actually wanted coils from the beginning but because of the straight part on my hair it wouldn't hold the coil so that's enough about my hair um yeah so I'm excited about it another another journey because I thought my locks was a lock journey, but you know, I cut that, so that wasn't really a journey. But this is gonna be a journey because it's gonna take a long time to grow out. So, anywho, I hope you guys are doing well. I hope you guys are being fantastic, being go get us, you know, go get us for life, go get us for Christ, go get us for education, go get us for success, all of that groovy stuff. Um, oh, and for you guys that are looking for me, I'm doing fine. I am just doing things so don't worry i'm still here i'm okay um and oh so what i wanted to ask you guys is like constipation do you guys with spina bifida have constipation problems um i know our digestive system is you know surprise is a little um out of whack but i don't know if that's for everybody like um i don't know what i'm trying to say i just wonder how you guys with spina bifida deal with constipation um for me it's like i feel like i'm just always constipated i feel like but at one point when nehemiah was born i was going frequently and I don't know what that, why that was. And now I'm thinking the only thing I was doing then, I think, was like taking prenatal vitamins. Um, I'm not sure, but I'm like, I try so many things like Metamucil and Miralax. Those things work, but because of the di my my like digestive system, my bowels and my uh, 
both you know number one and number two because we sometimes don't have control over those things the the laxatives work so good that they would make me go like and I didn't know it or I didn't like I wasn't prepared for it so I kind of had no control over it so I had to stop using those things um so now I use this product hold on hold on let me get it let me see if I can get it hold on guys Un momento, por favor. Okay, so now I use this. My coworker gave me some, and she kind of get kind of gave me too much. And it worked like instantly the same day. So it's super greens and you can get it at Walmart and it's organic greens, fruits and vegetables formula, raw super blend. It has 32 whole food extracts, organic kale, organic barley, grass, wheat grass, blue green, algae or algae, al a l g a e mixed berries with, um, uh, what is that? aloe and dairy free probiotics um it's a berry flavor it's really good you can mix it in water or you can um blend it in your morning smoothies like i do it's just a powder and it has like a little scoop Shh, nehemiah i'm recording it has a little scoop and i just use half of it i don't use all of it because like i said it it, it, it it works but it's like it was working and then it stopped working so now i'm like okay and you know i was blending my drinks my spinach my fruits you know my water my orange juice and now this and it seems like that was working now that stopped working and i'm like i just i don't know i want to find something that helps me go regular like i used to only go like once a week before nehemiah then when nehemiah came i was going every day now it's like it's like a hit and miss it's maybe two times or three times a week you know but I'm like what happened so I know people say more fiber so I'm like oh, now I gotta go get stuff with more fiber in it I'm gonna see if that works but I want to hear from you guys to know if you guys struggle from you know having constipation or like constipation you guys can google it if you don't know what it is but it's like when you go to the bathroom and you feel like you didn't get everything out or when you're bloated or your stomach hurts or cramps or whatever and like gas for me and i know i'm getting real personal but i mean this is what my channel is about um just being honest and learning new things especially with my disability and learning um from others with their disability so gas for me is like i get gas when I'm constipated and that's a constant thing for me because it's like I feel like I'm always constipated so I'm always gassy and I'm like so now what do I take gas X like I just don't want to put all kind of stuff in my body you know I don't want to be taking like laxatives and stool softeners and you know and gas X to try and get this thing under control I want to know what's working for other people is you know is it are you guys doing natural things are you guys doing the laxatives and the stool softeners and stuff like that i want to hear from you guys because it's kind of stressful you know because it's like as soon as i eat it's like i'm gassy and then the bowel doesn't come right away it takes some days and i'm like this is very uncomfortable like i just want to go poop like i don't know so i just want to hear from you guys and know you know if this is an issue for you guys um and yeah and i think that's all so i'm going to get this video posted just like this and no editing is on my phone so hopefully it'll be up sometime in the middle of today it's 11 10 a.m so we'll see when it goes when it comes up um thank you guys in advance for sharing with me please share with me let me know your thoughts let me know what you do let me know what you've heard works or things like that because i just want to get it under control i just want to have regular bowel movements i don't want to be backed up like it feels so much it feels good when you let that stuff out and when you're not constipated or bloated like or cramping and all that stuff like 
I just want to be normal. Like, me and my goes to the bathroom, like, every day. Or sometimes two to three times a day. And I'm like, we're, like, eating the same thing. It's like, is it really, you know, because of spina bifida that our digestive system is just how it is? I don't know. But, okay, guys. See you in another video. Like, share, subscribe. Thumbs up. Mwah.